Uh, hello you welcome to Bruce graphics tutorial where we will teach you how you can make outstanding graphics design with your smartphone all right um today we are going to show uh, to ourselves how we can actually use color codes in pixel app that is what we are going to do today so i'm going to show you step by step how you can use a hex color code in pixel app all right so uh before we go into the tutorial in full if you're not subscribed to the channel maybe if you're new to the channel subscribe to the channel we upload videos on this channel every week educative videos videos that will help you know more about applications that are related to graphics design and softwares as well that are related to that are used for graphic design uh, contents I believe you you will get much value from this um, channel so hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any new upload Friday by 10 a.m. new videos are uploaded like I've said all right so we're going to move straight to what we are supposed to do today like I said we are going to show to ourselves how we can use color codes in pixel app all right so i'm going to bring in um some codes that i have already so um let me position it very well so that we can see it. then i'm going to lock i'm going to lock it all right you can see where i'm locking it so that uh, it doesn't move even if i touch it all right so the other thing I, I want to do i will create shapes according to the colors that are there so i'll click the plus sign click shapes and then i'll just reduce it before i hit ok then I'm going to duplicate. I'll just create these shapes here. Then um, I'm going to duplicate it and then place accordingly uh, for all of them so that it um, will be easy for, for us. All right. Since I'm not doing a design, um, I don't need to use grid. I'm just using my uh, my visual appraiser to, to see how I'm placing them. I believe they are even placed very well. All right. So I'm going to click the first one here. And then um, for I, I want to get the exact colors for each of them. You can see them, all right? So the exact color for this, you can see the codes here. These are the codes, all right? And um, you know this these are hex hex codes. So these are the codes we are going to use to get these colors, all right? So um, after using the codes, I will show you how you can pick the colors as well, all right? So that um, you know maybe you see a color and there's no code for it or you you can find a code maybe where you cited the color there's actually where you can also pick those colors i believe you might be aware already uh, some of you might be aware already but um, maybe not all even if you're not aware i'm going to do that um, after i show you how you can use the color codes all right so i'm going to click the first shape and then come to color click color all right take note of of the the code over there enable the color is red scroll down and click the plus sign here click plus sign and then you will see these two um, action buttons here all right so we are going to go with with this one so this is the one you are going to click all right click it and then it will bring up this dashboard for you to enter the code all right for this one the hash is already um, is already placed at the beginning here all right if you're dealing with some other softwares you may need to put it by yourself but here it's already written so you may not need you don't need to write it again so the the next thing we're going to do just start from the letters uh or the numbers as the case may be letters and numbers they actually combined so we are going to the first the first code is f f c e three zero this is the first code when you are done with the code click um click this sign yeah this mark sign all right, when you click it, it will preview the color for you here. All right, so the first thing you click this, it will preview it for you here. All right, so let's click it and see. You can see the color up here has changed. So if you click OK and then you click OK, you are going to see that the color has moved to this color. So this color, this color here and this one here are the same. They are the same. All right, so we are going to move to the second one and do the same. Let's take note of um, the code. We're going to go to plus sign enable it um, plus sign yes then follow the same procedure and the code for it is um whether you use small letters let me use small letter for this one e8 e8 three eight four five hit it it will still change it to a capital letter so if you use small letter it's still going to work fine all right so uh, you hit okay so this is the color click the third one the same procedure enable the color click the plus sign 
click this and then enter the code this one is e3 it's 9b9 it is and it's changed all right it's okay click this one repeat it also all right so for this two i'm going to pick the colors instead of of um of writing the color code so that you could see i don't want to go over them and then come back all right so i'll pick this one and this one instead of um entering the color code so i'll click this one and then it's still going to give me the same thing click the plus sign enable it um click that that was called actually then click the plus sign now then instead of choosing instead of choosing this i will choose this this is the one i'll choose now so i'm going to choose this and then it will show me where to pick so all my elements will be here so where do i want to pick the color it's definitely here so when you click it click where you want to pick the color you can see that uh, if you click this it will become black so just navigate to where you're supposed to, to pick all right it has written the color code for us already you can see the color code here all right so you hit ok all right so you can see that has changed so i'll do the same thing for this enable color plus sign pick here i believe you saw where i clicked and then click the color here okay okay all right you can see that the colors are the same all right so this is how to enter color codes in pixel lab and also how to pick color so if you see a design and uh, maybe you want to use a color of maybe um, the image for the background or something you can definitely pick and you may reset it depending on the kind of um, uh, color scheme you want to use if it's monochromatic if it's complementary you can reset it if you pick it you can reset it let me demonstrate what i'm saying if you pick a color like this if you pick a color like this all right the color is picked already you can reset it from here to make it lighter you know to make it darker all right so um that's what i mean by resetting so depending on the kind of color scheme you're using you can do that or if you want to use it directly the way it is you can also do that all right thank you for watching um have a good time and please if you have not subscribed please subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell see you on friday next week